Alrighty, so welcome back to another session of core strength. We're gonna get at it at the hip flexors and the glutes today. That's gonna be a super quick workout. So let's just start off with some swings through the legs across the body, out to the side. Trying to get some dynamic movement in here, into the legs. Good, same side and front to back. Trying to bring that toe up nice and high. Keep your chest up nice and tall. Try not to bend the chest forwards. Good, and switching legs, swinging across the body and out to the side. Super big kick, toes up to the sky and across. Good work, and we're gonna kick front to back. Trying to kick your hand nice and high without bending forwards. Good, and we're gonna do a little forward fold. So just stepping into this staggered stance and just reaching towards the ground. So we're wor working our hip flexors today in pike compression. So we wanna get this range motion a little bit warmed up. Stagger on the other side, switch legs, and up and down. Just hinging at the hips, sit the bum way back. Good stuff. We're gonna come into this lunge. We're just gonna open through the hip flexor, reaching overhead. So make sure that you're getting this posture, pelvic tilt, squeezing through the back loop. And just reaching overhead, checking in. A little bit of a stretch in the lateral line, through the oblique, and into the lower back. Good, and just resting your fingers behind the ears. Again, same thing, squeeze the core, squeeze the bum, and just adding this little bit of a back bend. Moving back and forth. Good, switching legs. Other leg comes forwards. Same thing, posture, pelvic tilt the hips, squeeze the bum, and just reaching over five reps here, that's good. Resting fingers behind the ears, tuck the bum under, and we'll go into a little back bend. Good stuff. So, a little bit of movement in to start. We're gonna start with our glutes. So, first thing I'm gonna do is a side plank. We're gonna go onto the uh, Bottom leg up and top leg using that support on the foot. So you're gonna lift through the shoulder and coming into this side plank position. So we're just working inner thighs and really keeping that glute squeeze, hips open, obliques working. We're gonna go for 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. And switching sides. Okay, just trying to get some tension here on the inner thighs. So squeeze your bum, press away nice and strong through the shoulder, feel the obliques, and inner thigh muscles waking up for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. Good, switching sides. 
and we're gonna just lay down here, coming into this uh, 90 degree position, the knees a little bit forwards. And we're going to go into hip flexors to start, so I want you to pull your toe towards your forehead, control down, and lift up and down. We'll do 15 reps here, and that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Control down, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Good stuff. So we're going to drop the legs, straighten the leg out, toe down, heel up into the air, keeping a nice straight line from the heel through the hip and into the shoulder. So I, I have no piking uh, in the hip here. So I'm gonna squeeze my bum and just lift that heel to the sky. Notice we're not using hip flexors. We're starting to fire the glutes and lifting for two. Hold at the top for three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten, and hold, squeeze, good, and we're going to bend the leg this time, 90 degrees in the knee, and lift the leg up and down for ten, nine, eight, try and keep that hip open so we're not piking at the hip. Want to extend the hip and lift. Eight, seven, and six. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, and one. And we're going to lift into that end range of motion. Flex your foot and just lift as high as you can. Keep the heel in line with the knee and pump that heel back. Pump the heel back for two, three, four, five, six, seven, starting to cramp a little bit, eight, those muscles are on fire, nine, and 10. Good. We're gonna go super big circles in the leg here. So making sure that the hips are nice and stacked over one another, lift up, Come to the front and then all the way around. For 10, big circle, control it. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Switching direction, leg up to the front and coming around for 10. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good work. And let's switch sides and do the same on the other side. So again, the goal here is to create nice, strong, and stable hips. So first thing we're gonna do is hip flexor. We're gonna lift the toes up, trying to bring the toe to the forehead. 15 of these, control up and down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Good work. So we're gonna internal rotate the foot, heel up, toes down, and making a nice straight line through the body. Lifting through that heel, up and down, for two, three, already feeling it, four, 
five. The bottom leg does a little work here as well. So these muscles are already awake. And six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good. So 90 degree bend in the knee. We want to try not to pike at the hip. So I'm going to open or extend the hip and simply lifting the leg, keeping the leg horizontal or knee at the same height of the heel. And that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, good. And the last one here before we circle is our kickback. I'm gonna lift up and pump the heels back for 10. Nine, really work it, try and get into that end range. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good work, almost done here. Legs are on fire, booties are on fire. Big circle and coming around for 10. Nine, eight, try and control it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, last one, big circle, everyone with me. Here we go, and 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. So that is a quick glute routine. We're gonna finish off with a spicy little hip flexor finish. So just giving the body a little bit of love here, moving back and forth through the hips, internal external rotation into that 90-90. All right, so the next one we're gonna do is all on the elbows. And we're gonna really work adductors and hip flexors here. So just leaning back. First one, bring your knees as tight as you can into the chest. And we're just gonna control out and lift for one and 10 reps. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and ten and alternating legs hold pull the knee to the chest and switch and hold and hold that's three four five six seven eight nine and ten good legs up try and get this full vertical leg position and we're going to work adductors, hold at the bottom, squeeze your bum, try and pull those legs apart, and lift for 10. Nine, eight, feel those muscles at the bottom. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, straight legs. Up and down, hold at the bottom, pull the toe towards the forehead on the top leg, and switch for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, pull those legs apart, nice and, four, nice and wide, 4, super wide, pull, 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 3, 2, and 1, good, almost there. We're gonna uh, bring the legs in and out this time, all the way down and cross and cross. Let's go for 10, nine, eight, crossing legs at the top, seven, 
six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, hold those feet at the top. We're almost done. And we're gonna cross fast for 20. One, and two, back and forth. Three, four, five. Speed them up, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 10 more, 11, faster, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20, good, two more drills, we're going to go on to the bum, and we're going to drop all the way down into our hollow body, right here, and lift into this tuck up. Ready, let's go, in and out, for one, 15 reps, two, three, four, five, get them done, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, five more, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15, last one, for a little finish in the upper abs and lower abs. Legs up, lie down. Here we go, 15 toe touches and reaching for one, two, finish up. Let's go, three, four, five, six, seven, almost done. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Whew. Well done, everyone. Come into a little upward dog, if you like, to stretch that out. And just move around side to side. You can walk one knee up. Just stretch, open the hips. <sighs> Switch legs. If you're doing the single leg upward dog with me. And just moving around and stretching out and that's it for your quick hip flexor and glute routine thank you all for joining me and stay awesome <laughs>